I'm good. being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So, so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit enough. me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're not criminals! They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh my God, don't do that to him. You he guys don't know what did. you're doing to me, man. Why? Where are you? Ma'am, stay right here. Ma oh, man. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Ma no, you can't, you can't go You guys really don't know what you're doing in my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to sunny Los Angeles, California, where we find Sidewalk Boy and his moronic pal, Nasty Nathaniel. Little Nasty Nathaniel, that just sounds nasty, doesn't it? Yeah, they stop in the police station and get punked by an ordained minister. How lovely is that? Yeah, that's great. And then Sidewalk Boy wants to run to the police for help. Oh, oh, he's harassing me. Yeah, right. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Go home and cry to your mama. No doubt. Let's all sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. Do don't touch me, okay? No, don't don't touch, okay? Don't, don't touch. touch. Don't, don't touch. Who are you? I'm a point at you, of course. Okay, go away. You're no one. I didn't give you permission to play yourself yeah, and give a business card. Can I just finish this? I'll give it to you right now. Yeah. Let me just finish. Thank you for being professional. Uh -huh. You see? You don't have to. Excuse oh. me, officer. <laughs> You're very handsome. This Yahoo pictured on the right side is Nasty Nathaniel. Yeah, Nasty Nathaniel, isn't he something? Now he walks right up to a cop he never met before and says, Oh, you're very handsome. Now, what kind of a man walks up to another man and says he's handsome? Only Nasty Nathaniel. He looks a little off if you get my drift. Let's carry on. Can I ask you something? Why is it like... Stacks of a hundred bills. Woo! See it? A big old stack. Ten to twenty grand on the spot. But I'm not gonna count the whole stack, everyone. Pierre Benjamin's. Okay, let's say for a moment that this is real money. Why would you carry that much money and why would you flash it in public? Clearly, you're somewhere in public in Los Angeles. What is wrong with you? I say we all take a plane out to Los Angeles. We know where this Yehu lives. Let's go jack him. Now, as also, I want you to notice here, you see how he's changed from the restaurant to inside a police station to flashing his cash all in about the span of a minute and a half? Again, there's something wrong with the boy. 
Yeah, there was a guy that was, he got up on his chair and wanted to fight me. The cops did a good job. Yeah. Even though I film you every day. I'm here with a serious situation and these officers are trying to help me. Why are you wasting their time? None of your business. Why are you getting in business that doesn't belong to you, sir? I think that you're the ones who are creating the problem. It's people like you who are people creating like the me, problem. People like me who need help of the police. Yeah, and sir. And you come here to waste their time. Well, sir, we're not stopping you from conducting your whatever police business you're doing. I think that you're inhibiting the entire community, man. Not my fault you feel hurt. That's not my fault, sir. Sorry, one for each, okay? Can you calm down to this individual here? Because you see, when Richard Aguirre is confronted by a man, he folds. That's right, because he can only stand up to women and senior citizens. Other than that, he's a little sissy boy. He'll call his mommy. Oh, he'll call his mommy and she'll come and help him. Yeah, look at this guy. Man, I tell you, I wish I lived in Los Angeles. I would punk this kid every day of the week. I don't know what he's... I'm using my freedom of speech and I'm filming you just the same rights that you have. Yeah. Come here and you're act like an asshole. I'm doing the same thing to you. How do you like that? You want my card? I'm an ordained minister. Would you like to see my card? For what? You're not important. For what? You're not important. Get the hell out of here. No, that's a no. What's your name? What's your names? Hmm? Where do you live? Here you go. Hmm? Get the respect, you get the respect back, sir. Yeah, the, the way you guys show yeah. respect. Go, put it on YouTube. It is gonna go on YouTube. You already know the drill. Yeah, it is gonna go on YouTube. You're gonna look how dumb you look on camera, sir. Wait a minute. Isn't it like the pot calling the kettle black? How stupid you're gonna look, okay? Don't you touch my phone. Uh, you remember when he got spit in his face? That's in my opening credits, man. Hey, but it's worth another look. Let's roll that clip. She spit me on my face right now. She spit in my face. Right now she spit in my face. I got a camera. Yeah, you look really stupid. I'm here with a child abuse report and you guys are in here making problems. You came up to the camera. Yeah. Stopping you from conducting whatever business They're trying to help me right now. He's the one who came up. Don't start with your thing. They're trying to help me right now. He's the one who came up. No, he came up to us, okay? How can you say he's the one who came up? See? That's a way we don't like you because you don't do your job. You tell him to leave me alone. Then how about that? He's the one who came up to my camera. And what's your name and badge number, sir? Four, four, one, Let me get a business card. It's on there. Yeah, I'm going to probably report you for what you just said. He's the one who came up to my camera, sir. <laughs> you're in a public place. And you're telling him I'm leaving alone. You heard that, Nasty? Yeah, yeah. Well, now, looks like it's all over. But wait, there's more. Because Sidewalk Boy's not done yet. He still wants to run his mouth because that's what he does best. Man, I'm just hoping one day somebody shuts him up. Oh, please, isn't there somebody in Los Angeles that can help us out? What happens when someone individual comes up like that? It's freedom of speech. Just yeah, but that's not freedom of speech. Last time a guy came out of here, he wanted to swing and they took him out of the lobby. So that's what's freedom of speech when someone wants to swing at you too? It's not the same, right? That's not freedom of speech anymore. Yeah, that's it. Uh, you're inciting somebody to a fight. But that's How come this guy was say, telling me, mm -hmm. leave him alone when he came to, up to my camera? The people are who come up to my camera. So he's just trying to tell you that you can record and he can record and just, you know. Both yeah, you this is not illegal. What I'm not doing, I'm doing expressing my rights as an American. You know the First Amendment? Mm -hmm. What does it say? Yeah, yeah. You must know it. You became an officer. Mm -hmm. Freedom of speech. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
doesn't make sense to start problems like that. This guy comes looking for problems. Not cool. And, then, and it's not just today. Everywhere I go, people are calling police. Hey, sidewalk boy, what the hell do you know about the First Amendment? Where are you from, anyway? Did you come here from Mexico? You and your mama? Hmm. What happened? Your daddy left you, and then what? She had to move here for a better life? Is that what it is? I tell you one thing. You're not from the United States. You moved to the United States, and you know nothing. You're a bloody idiot. And I tell you what, man, I think we should go to Los Angeles and take his cash, find out if it's real or not. Yeah, he probably does have money, though. He always brags he doesn't pay any bills. Stay with your mama rent-free, huh? What kind of man does that? 29-year-old sissy boy. Man with a camera. For one, for no reason. You probably got a lot of calls about me, which I'm always out there filming. Man with a camera, man with a camera, and they're almost crying for no reason. I don't know what's the problem with filming in public. <laughs> no, not everybody knows you know, the First Amendment. Yeah, I like it when average professionals, when they know what's going on, not trying to defend another person. Because I filmed, them, they know who I'm here. I always film you guys for years. Thank you for being professional. I hope uh, they see this video and they learn something from it. Right, it's not cool it. when people come and try to... It's not freedom of speech when they try to swing now. It's different. Mm -hmm. Like it happened a week ago here. In this lobby. Sidewalk Boy has nearly been clocked several times. We can only continue to hope that one day he gets the wrong one on the wrong day. And I'm telling you, he'll see stars. Yeah, and it won't be the kind they're in Hollywood either. Yeah, let's keep hoping for that day. All right, have a good one. Bye-bye, loser. Yeah. Well, there you have it, folks. Just a little punk that I really don't like. Man, I have never liked this guy. The first video I watched of him where he stood around and harassed patrons who were trying to dine out stores. Oh, man. There's something wrong with this guy. And then he's got the nerve to put that idiotic stuff on his YouTube channel. If you don't support the First Amendment, you don't belong in America. Well, you don't support the First Amendment, so get out, Junior. Not to worry. If you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by, Sidewalk Boy, you little punk. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. So you assaulted She assaulted me. Oh, no. No, you're racist. Kate racist. Oh, racist, that's a hate crime. You're being We're disorderly. Gonna... Call, call the police. Morons, call please, the police. Please. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You'll go to jail, jail bro. Go ahead, put Stop your hands on me. me bro. Put your hands on me. Really, no reason I'm, really, to have... I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm going to arrest you for trespassing yeah, in a minute. Yeah, on public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, she's right in my face, guys. You, you just assaulted me, ma'am. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Salami hala handula, alu akbar, haknui kanda kra, ula wala pupatai.